Lexi, wait, oh, no, <laughs> this is not that channel. Hey, Royal Beauties, and welcome back to another video. So, you guys, in today's video, I will be going to Myrtle Beach. I'm taking my man, my man, my man, and my man. My man. Thank you to my man. Drop to the Myrtle Beach Safari. I'm we're so excited. Like, that is where you get to go to hold baby tigers and baby monkeys and all of that, and all the animals. So, I'm really looking forward to that. We're about to take that drive to Myrtle Beach. And we're gonna have fun this weekend, you know? I love a nice little spontaneous, quick getaway, so I'm really looking forward to this. But before we get into the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and tell a friend, tell a friend about life with Lex. Now let's get straight into the video. Okay, y'all, so hold on, drive. I'm trying to drive on the court. I gotta go to the post office real quick, but. <clears throat> so this is the tea. I've been to Myrtle Beach. This is gonna be my third time going. This is my man, first time going. And he think he about to drive there fast as Sonic, thinking that it's not gonna be no traffic. And just listening to the GPS, like it's not gonna be no traffic on a Friday when we are not the only ones traveling. And it's um 9.23. I told him we should've left at eight in the morning and I just called him and he's still in the bed asleep. Why are you sleeping? Like, we have places to go. So, we have like a six hour drive, six, seven hour drive, and I wanted to go out to eat to um, Dirty Dons, because last time I went, oh my God, they seafood so good, so we going there. But I wanted to have time to go to the winery too, but now that's out the question, that's not happening, because they close at seven, and we gonna get there at like four or five, and I know we are gonna be hungry when we get there, so he not gonna wanna go to the winery and then go out to eat. So, I just wish he would get it together, thinking he know everything, but we still gonna have a good time. I'm not even worried about it. I'm taking him there, because I wanted to do this for him, so if you don't want to go to the winery, we don't got to go to the winery. Me personally, if I'm traveling somewhere, I want to do everything while I can, while I'm there. But hey, that's just me. But I'm going to let him rock. But yeah, that's what's going on. I'm super hungry. I'm ready to eat. And I know he probably hungry too. So hopefully we get there like at a reasonable time, you guys. But that's what's currently going on right now. A few minutes later. Update for you guys. So I just pulled up to my boyfriend's house. He didn't take a shower. It's 10 o'clock. Um, I don't think he's finished packing, but I'm not gonna get an attitude because I'm growing and maturing. So I'm gonna go with the flow and I'm gonna be happy. <laughs> I'm not starting a mess. We having fun on this trip, period. So you guys, it's 1046 and we're just now getting in the car. So we're basically leaving at 11 o'clock when I say we should leave at eight. We're leaving three hours later. I'll wait for him to get in the car so y'all can see him. Taking all day. Everybody yeah, meet the Don't man of the hour. Don't be happy now. <laughs> Babe, this is your fault. I said we should leave at 8 and you want to leave at 11. Don't try to have an attitude now. When is your fault? Six hours later. Sound right there. I like the way that sound right there. I like the way that sound right there. He don't want to. 
This is why I came, y'all. This is my favorite thing from here. So, y'all, the food was really good. I don't need that my edges edging no more, but the food was really good. I'm so full. Look at my stomach. <laughs> oh my gosh. I look like I'm um, six months pregnant. That's a food baby, y'all. That seafood mm, with the extra old bay, so good. It was good. It was so good. I love that place. We in here getting some Krispy Kreme donuts. I we just ate all that food. <laughs> I'm not eating mine till the morning because no, I don't have no space for no donut right now. <laughs> I'll really be getting you right now. So you guys, the food hat is ready to lay down. So we decided to play a scary movie and just go to sleep because we have to get up early for the Myrtle Beach Safari. So you guys, we just left the Myrtle Beach Safari. So they gave you food along with it and you can get pictures and stuff with it too. So it was a lot of fun. We got the whole chimpanzee. At the stop sign, turn um, left onto Sakasa Boulevard. Like all type of cat animals and you got to see the tigers and stuff like that. So it was really, really fun. And I'm glad he liked it too. We're at the Hollywood Wax Museum now. I'm out of every two. Okay, what you gonna do with Iron Man then? J Lo and Ben Affleck. They're both Leos. Okay. Maybe that's why they get along so well. Pirates of the Caribbean. Okay. This looks good. This 
좋아서 아, 이 o u <laughs> you don't want to take no pictures with none of them. You don't want to get some weight beside him. You take pictures? Yes, you can. This is props. They want you to do all that. Yeah. I might even have shorts. He's a tourist. Oh, he tell you what his, his um, tattoos mean. Having a family, protecting family, and warrior spirit. Yeah, sound like him. I forgot his name. I know who this is. Oh, yeah, Mark who is that, babe? Yes, you know your own got this. With Ted. Take your pictures with the wackest ones, right? Shit. I'm gonna get all of them. That's true. Dang. Dang. Where is he from? Without Bad trying to, name. without trying to look at the thing. Where he from? Uh, oh. Shooter. Yeah. yeah, Libra. Who is this? Audrey. Audrey. Playboy. Okay, I will. I gotta put the ears on. <laughs> I gotta put the ears on. Make it to one of the... Hey, which one was it? Oh, right. 
job, good job. Is it talk to you? Talk to y'all. Oh, that's you. I hope that was with me. <laughs> I do one with Jackie Chan. She look better than this. Whitney Houston. Michael Jackson. Oh my God. Michael. Yes, I love him. Taylor Swift. Lady Gaga. Cardi B wear thick veil. Period. Oh, she look kind of black. I thought that, but she look kind of black. Rondi Wilmes, cause she is so pretty in her life. Uh-uh. Oh, I know she was a cancer. I wrote that June 25th. Uh, Rihanna. Oh, of course. She the core. She is a Gemini. June 16th. You taller than him. You see if I'm taller than him. I'm taller than him. Ali! Hers is realistic. Yeah, Jim Carrey. <laughs> She was so lonely, her own reflection became her best friend. We thought at the end of the Oh snap, okay. Oh! You want me to get out of the way? Oh, 
are crazy. Wow, why are we going to the door? What is all the dumb dirt? The Wax Museum now we at Helicopter Adventures. About to do a helicopter ride for twenty. You excited? Yeah. <laughs> $6 per person one instead of doing the $20 one, huh? Seven, six, three, Excuse me.
chill. Okay? I'm about to get in the water, you guys. So who's gonna pull for five seconds? Cause the storm came, unfortunately. I was really enjoying myself in the ocean. The next month. Okay, you guys, our stay here at Myrtle Beach is coming to an end. Today is our last day. We're checking out at 11, but we had a great time. The heat in South Carolina is not no joke though, y'all. It is so hot right now outside. I stepped on the balcony, had to go right back in. But I'm about to show y'all how I do my edges just in case I have edges that look like mine. I think I got like 4C here, 4C or 4B. This is how you get them laid. So first you need your got to be um, gel, the clear invincible styling gel. This is what I use. So the first thing I do, the first thing I do is <laughs> gel my edges down with this straight and then you need to have the purple top 24 hour edge tamer extreme firm hold and then that's what i use to curl it swoop it swoop it and then lastly i spray it with it got to be free spray so it can stay in place and you have you have you have you have to put on a scarf after all of that and lay your edges down so it can stay like that don't do all of that and not put no scarf down because it's not gonna work so let's get into it and then i'll tell y'all about like what we've been doing here at Myrtle Beach too. So yeah, you guys, I wanted to make sure since it was his first time coming here that he did um, most of the tourist attractions. I took him to Broadway at the beach yesterday, but um, that was after we had already did the Myrtle Beach Safari and that was from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. And then we did the helicopter ride. So he was kind of like tired after that. So we went to um, this barbecue place that this lady re recommended at Broadway the beach. It was not all of that. I showed y'all the little video, the plate. It won't give him what we thought it was gonna give, but it was good enough for who was cooking it. So then we came um, back to the room. We put on our bathing suit and got in the water at the beach. The water is so relaxing. Like, I love the beach here. The water is warm. The waves are beautiful. Like I just really felt at peace. I could have stayed out there for hours, but I know he didn't want to be out there that long. So then we came in here and just watched Fairly Odd Parents for a little bit, and then we went to go to this place called Scooby's Ice Cream Bar and Grill. And I just got some kind of candy ice cream. That was good. He, I got some chicken tenders that he didn't like, but the ice cream was really, really good. But uh, we went to bed. And now, this lady on TikTok, uh, like a few weeks ago, she hit me up and she seen that my other Murder Beach video got over a million views. So she was like, next time you come to Murder Beach, let me know so that way we can take care of you, pay for your meal, as long as you like do a video of our restaurant. Now their restaurant is called National House of Pancakes and um, they logo is like IHOP but instead of IHOP is IN-HOP. So we going in for breakfast because they're going to pay for our food and she pretty much said we can get what we were going as long as we, um, as long as I record a video of my food and stuff and while I'm there and you know, you know a TikTok video giving a review on the restaurant. 
So that's what I'm gonna do. And then we're gonna be headed home. But we had a good time for this little weekend getaway. He had a good time. I mainly did it for him. So he can have fun here. We mainly came for the Murder Beach Safari, but I just added um, some stuff since we were gonna be here for a whole weekend. I wanted to take him to Wonderworks, but he, like I said, he was tired by the time he was at Broadway at the beach. Cause there's a lot to do at Broadway at the beach. So maybe next time. But he had a good time and that's all that matters. Okay, so now you see how my edges is, I, I brushed them all straight and rubbing it with my finger. So that product can really get up in there. And this is making it stiff, firm. So now I'm gonna get a little bit of my purple top edge control. And now you're gonna make little C's and swoop, swoop, and use your finger at the same time, like rubbing it. So whoop, so whoop, so whoop. So let me stop. Boom, boom. Just C's and rubbing it. C's and rubbing it. Since I've been um, learning how to do my edges good, sometimes I do a little curl with it too. Like, something like that, but I ain't, mm -mm. I ain't that pro yet. Sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. Okay, so that's that part. Once you lay the scarf down, it, it just all come together. Oh, and you gotta have a toothbrush, an old, stale. This ain't got so much gel kicking up on it, so that's why it's like easy for me to use it for my um, edges. Cause it's hard. It's like a little mini brush. This side is a little bit harder because the um, back gel already is like setting in there. So it made it stiff. So I just got to brush it a little harder. Also, since my uh, braid's a little old, I'm gonna put some loops on the back of my, these, this part. So, that can lay down with the scarf. All right, close up. Now you got to immediately put that scarf on. You need to have it on for at least like 10 minutes. Okay, and then we're gonna see how it look in about 10 minutes. This is my outfit for the National House of Pantry. Something simple. I had a really cute outfit that I didn't even get to wear. Cause Friday we just um, chilled for real, but you can never go wrong with a nice chill fit, can you? Still letting my scarf sit. I wish I could get back in the beach water. It's so relaxing. It water is so warm, like, oh my gosh. I wish our water was like that back at home. Okay, so it's been like 10 minutes, but the longer you keep it up there, the better. But I just wanna do 10 minutes, cause I told y'all 10 minutes. So. 
you see? Laid. And your edges can withstand the heat and all of that. They'll be laid all day as long as you use all of those products. Period. The full complete outfit. Oh, is that too low? See my shade, match my shorts. Then I got this cute purse. And I put the glasses behind my. Crunchy. Here we are. It's a long line out here, y'all. Yeah. Nika bought us these big drinks, y'all. You like dragon fruit, baby? Oh, you don't like it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Y'all yeah. be giving us VIP service here. They just took pictures of us, gave us these drinks. So last time you saw us, we were at the National House of Pancakes. The service was phenomenal. It was 100 out of 10. They are so attentive. Even your waitress, if it's not her coming up to the table asking what you want, it's the other people working there asking if it's anything that you need, anything that they need to go get for you. Um, that restaurant was amazing. All of our stuff was free, of course, because I'm going to um, post a TikTok 
of uh, us being there, but she made sure we had everything. Like she was offering stuff that even we, we weren't trying to get, cause you know we don't want to take advantage. But she was like saying, you know, y'all need to get this, that, and the third. So she was just great. Her name was Shamika, and she was so so phenomenal, so sweet, so nice, and just overall amazing. Now five and a half hours later, we are back home. So I'm about to drive home. We made it back home. Um, we had a nice road trip there, nice road trip back, and yeah, we love Myrtle Beach. I'm glad my boo had a good time. That's his first time going. He said he would not mind going again. So yeah, overall it was a great time. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend about Life with Lex. And we'll see where I go next, you guys. Okay, period. See you next video. Yeah.